I want to warn you about a potential safety risk in a pretty popular area. Our cameras documented a threat to trail users at a crossing in Plano. Our CBS 11's J.D. Miles is there for you tonight to share exactly with you what he found. It took only seconds for our camera to capture drivers ignoring this red light that's supposed to protect people on the trail who are crossing here at Alma Road. An avid cyclist who's had his share of close calls believes it's only a matter of time before someone is injured or worse. I'll try to get on the trail by 6.30. Tracy Nix is halfway into his daily 15-mile bike ride across Plano at a place he dreads crossing. It's scary. Tell me about your close calls here. Every day. That's because the 65-year-old is captured with his helmet-mounted camera. Many of the near misses his bike has had with passing vehicles. It's because of drivers on Alma Road just north of Spring Creek who don't obey a flashing red light that trail users can activate by pushing a button. Which means everybody both directions is supposed to stop. They don't. Nix has complained to the Plano Police Department that the crossing is unsafe. He knows what it's like to be struck by a car, as this video shows, when a driver not paying attention hit and seriously injured Nix last year at a nearby intersection. And when the car hit me, my leg went under her car, took all the skin, bruised me from head to toe. I don't know if I can describe it. You know, I was in shock for two weeks. You can see, after we set up our camera, cars and trucks constantly drove through the flashing red light as if it wasn't even there. Cyclists like Nix, who are safety conscious, prefer riding on trails over streets. He wants to see a standard traffic signal here. This is the safest trail that I can think of except for this red light or flashing light or whatever it is called. And uh, I don't know one cyclist that likes it. We received a statement from Plano Police about these concerns. It says in part, while motor vehicles overwhelmingly occupy our public roadways, we acknowledge that pedestrians and roadway cyclists are at risk when individuals disregard local and state traffic laws. In an effort to minimize these crashes, the department will continue to monitor our intersections, take enforcement action when necessary, and educate the public about roadway safety. In Plano tonight, J.D. Miles, CBS 11 News.